hello guys this is shubhadeep welcome to my channel so in this tutorial we will see the products which are sold repeatedly all over the years okay so here you can see we have uh, in my database there are 2011 to 2015 data okay and this is product name count of product name and profit so i want to see there are several products i want to see the products which are used which are sold when uh, in which year and which month of the year okay how many times a single product is sold so for this i have created a single a simple uh, dax function that is count of products here you can see i have created a dax function count of product of name okay then i have taken a matrix visualization so where uh, here you can see if i if i click like this here you can see this particular product only used in only sold in 2014 and how many times three times okay if i expand all over this here you can see in 2014 in september month one time this product sold and in november two times this product sold okay so like this if i click on here for this product you can see 2011 2012 and 2014 these three years this particular product is sold how many times in 2011 2 times 2012 5 times and 2014 3 times if i expand this here you can see 2011 june and july 2012 january october november and december and 2014 september october december this product is sold it is cool so like this we can calculate okay so one thing if i uh, write like this not not about count if i write like distinct count what happens distinct count what will be the difference let's see here you can see sorry if i create like this here you can see this is getting 1 1 1 everything is becoming 1 why it is distinct count so if a product is sold okay a particular time it is not counting another time when it is sold it is counting distinct product distinct count okay so if a product is uh, if it is uh, if it is getting one product one time then it is not counting repeatedly when is when this product is sold again that is why it is distinct count so we should not use distinct count we should use only count okay for this we can see in every product when and how many times this product is sold so it is very useful we can search randomly okay so i think this is the thing i have to say today so if you like my channel please subscribe it if you like my videos please like it share it among your friends support to my channel thank you guys thank you